I, I was born in Japan, mm -hmm. but uh, my, my thought, mm -hmm. my thinking, mm -hmm. my uh, lifestyle, yeah. perfectly not Japanese. Uh, I understand. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, as you would have seen by the title, I'm going to a Jamaican restaurant in Shibuya. I've been wanting to go to this restaurant for a very long time. So I'm going to go there with my Japanese friend Marina, who you guys would have seen before. And we're going to try some Jamaican food. I think this is her first time trying a few things. Um, so I'm going to record her reaction to that. And I'm going to give you guys my overall review of the restaurant. So if you're interested in that, then stay tuned and keep on watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys when I get to Shibuya. Let's go. So I ordered jerk chicken, pizza, and uh, this is Marina's. She ordered rice and peas and oxtail with red stripe beer. And I also ordered a can of it because it's been so um, You've had oxtail before, Jamaican oxtail? Yeah. I don't know if I tried over this. What's this? Jerk pork. Oh, okay. You eat pork? Yeah. Okay. And um, this is Akian Saltfish. And have you ever tried Festival? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you're going to try Festival. festival. Yeah. Uh, I've heard the name. Um, have you ever tried Akian Saltfish? No. No? Okay, so you're going to try it. Sometimes we eat these two together. Okay. Or you can have uh, Festival and... Uh, the Jackpot? Yeah, together. So you can decide which you want to have together. And you can try the jerk chicken um, pizza. Yeah. It is not bad, actually. Yeah? Yeah, it's not bad. I want another Jamaican restaurant in Bohamai. Where? Um, I don't remember the name of place, but um, um, this um, 30 minutes from Yokohama station. This really? Yeah, I went there with my friends. I yeah. didn't know that there was one. I know that there's one in... Saint John, I don't remember, but it's called Bushman. Mm. It's not that. It's a D something. Mm. Yeah, I've never heard of that one. But there, mm -hmm. sometimes they, they, um, they have a Jamaican party or something. Oh. Ah. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's interesting. You're going to have to tell me the name because I've never heard of that one before. Because it's, um, it's very far from the It's very far? It takes like maybe 30 or 40 minutes from the Yokohama station. Okay. How mm. was the oxtail? <laughs> My next one is more spicy. I forgot you love spicy food. <laughs> How would you rate this? <laughs> Mm. Honest. I'm really hungry. <laughs> you're gonna give it a high grade because you're hungry. And then also it's good. I like it. I'm gonna try this and this and this yet. Okay. And this later. <laughs> I'm waiting on you to try these. This is what I'm waiting for you to try. Mm mm. Not yet. I want us to try it together. Mm. Mm -hmm. I wonder if he speaks English. I'm trying to figure out if he speaks English. I don't know. I want to. Huh? Wagwan? 
Excuse me, have you ever been to Jamaica? We never been there. Mom. Never been there. But, uh, <laughs> me last time. You know? Oh, you're Rastafarian. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I, I, I have been carrying my rocks mm -hmm. for 18 years. 18 this years. Time. Oh. This is the third time for me. Okay. Yeah. So we have a, a little bit of Japanese Rasta. Okay. Japan. My name is Rasnobu. Rasnobu, okay. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. What's your name? Stacia. 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 Mm. What's your name? Marina. Marina. Oh, that's not bad. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. Are you Jamaican? Yeah, I'm Jamaican. <laughs> you should go to Jamaica. Uh, I have plan to go there. Okay. But uh, actually, I lived in Las Vegas, U.S. Right? Okay. Before. Yeah, there's a reggae band mm -hmm. from Monte Bay. Were you in the reggae band? Yeah, I was in the reggae oh. band. Oh! They are called Stephen Brothers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Did you Honor sing or did you play an instrument? I play in uh, Naya Bingi. Oh, okay. Yeah, so then last time. <laughs> so percussion. Okay. But uh, I, I'm, I sing my original chill. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It is hard to trans translate uh, English Japanese. Mm -hmm. Not good fit fix. Yeah, I understand. <laughs> but uh, I, I, I try to sing by English. Okay. Patoa. Okay. You understand Pato? A little bit. A little? Okay. But, uh, you know, it is hard to make understand mm. what I say. Okay. <laughs> so I have to sing by Japanese. <laughs> <laughs> How did you find out about Jamaica? How did you learn about Jamaica? Oh, because uh, uh, I have a Jamaican friend. Mm -hmm. You know the Ropongi. Ropongi. Right? We had so we we kid live reggae club. Uh huh. In Ropongi. Mm -hmm. Long time ago. Mm -hmm. It's about almost a. Uh, uh, over 30 years ago. Then there was a Jamaican Rasta musician uh, come, come to Japan okay. and to play reggae, reggae music. music. Then I went to there. Then I linked up with the Jamaican Rasta okay. artist. Uh -huh. And then I ran Jamaican Rangage culture. What was the name of the, what was the, name of the man, the Rasta? Uh, the, the, most famous Jamaican Rasta in Japan is Maka Laughing. Really? Yeah, Dave, uh, Dave Anthony Makana. Mm, I don't know him. His, his, uh, his brother, elder brother, yeah. was in Japan. He played in Lopongi. Mm -hmm. his, his name is Winston Electric Makana. He's from original rockers. Okay. He, he, he lives in uh, France now. Ah. And he play over there. And his younger brother, David Makana. Okay. Makala Fink. That's ah. Jamal in Japan. Mm. He's going to try to have a um, big Jamaican festival. When? And, um, that uh, that's going to delay, delay, delay because of the because virus. Of, uh, mm -hmm. coronavirus. Yeah, 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 yeah. The festival name is Queen Nani Festival. Uh, the, you know the Japanese TV program You Are Nani Shin Nippon? No, I don't. You don't know? I know. You know, know. that, right? I, What's that? YouTube. So uh, basically, they are because before mm -hmm. Japan used to have a lot of tourists from mm -hmm. foreign countries, so that's why. They go to the airport or I don't yeah, know. Yeah, Narita Airport. Oh, why did you come to Japan yeah. or something like that? Yeah. Yeah, I've heard of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But then that's actually, um, I think these days, Japan try to make a lot of uh, um, TV show like this mm -hmm. to 
um, education in this video mm -hmm. about different cultures and then about the situation of a foreigner living in Japan okay. so that they can have an idea how the life is foreigners being uh, foreigners in Japan mm. or how like the, um, the um, tourists think about Japan or anything like this. This is his guy, Dave Anthony Makana, mm -hmm. Makalafin. Okay. The, this picture from uh, One Love Jamaica Festival. Ah, uh, I've heard uh, of you, that. You, 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 uh, yeah, I've heard of that. Are you in this picture? Yeah, this is me. Ah, so good. Yeah. And then we have Japanese Rasta like this. And then Japanese Rasta support mm. Jamaican Rasta. Okay. Then we chant, chant on the place and to chant on the place. And uh, so, uh, actually I lived in the US, mm -hmm. Las Vegas. I met a lot of Jamaican famous artists like, uh, for example, um, Dare Kara Iko Kana. Well, well, well. Well, okay, this is it. Ah, Bu Buju Bantan! It's good! In California. Ah. Before he realized Wait. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Before he so you love reggae music? Yeah, I love reggae music. Mm, okay. I don't like reggae. <laughs> oh, no, I love it. Uh, Las Vegas reggae people. Everybody know me. Uh, when did you return to Japan? Uh, 2011. Yeah. Except, uh, so July. Oh, okay. I remember the date. Mm -hmm. like 15th. Because I don't want to come back. I don't want to come back. Come back to Japan. <laughs> Nande, why? It is hard to live in here. I, I was born in Japan, but uh, my my thought, mm -hmm. my thinking, mm -hmm. my uh, lifestyle. Yeah. Perfectly not Japanese. Ah, style. I understand. And there I carry my dreadlocks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Reggae, hey, reggae man. Oh, <laughs> man you know? It yeah. is hard to explain yeah. from the first, the start to the end. Yeah, I understand. Yeah, I think by myself, I'm from Africa. No, oh, you are? Yeah, because, uh, uh, what, what can I say? My, Actually, I sing by uh, original style, mm -hmm. my, my song. The, the, the title is Where Are You From? Mm -hmm. Because uh, when I was in the US, everybody said first time, the words, the, the words came out from them. Where are you from? Mm -hmm. Because I carry the dreadlocks mm -hmm. in the Japanese. And uh, I worked at the cowboy ranch. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Japanese Red Rocks cowboy. Cowboy. <laughs> so yeah. I said my myself by introduced by myself. I am one. I am the one and only in the world. Ninja Rasta I mean... cowboy. <laughs> <laughs> what do you call this? What do you call it? What's the name? Jack Jerk chicken seasoning. Okay, I will try it. Thank you. Chicken and the pork and the shrimp, all okay. All okay. <laughs> we got free merchandise, guys. Restaurant, and because it's of the state of emergency, um, we're unable to like go out, out. So we're trying to see what we can find to do because I don't feel like going home. so I made it home and I had a really nice evening today I would definitely recommend that you guys try out Goodwood if you're ever in Japan if you're ever in the Tokyo area the staff speaks both both English and Japanese and based on the conversation I had with the person the guys who were there uh, when I visited they've been to Jamaica before so they have some knowledge about the Jamaican culture I mean I cook my own Jamaican meals at home and to be very honest if I were working there I would do a better job obviously because I'm Jamaican but it's nice to be 
somewhere where you're having Jamaican meal that is not prepared by you. Um, so I did enjoy my time there. And doko 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 doko. And as you would have seen, they were kind enough to give me um, some Jamaica, uh, some good wood Jamaican jerk seasoning. You know, we were just there. And one of the cool things I love about being in Japan, I've been so open about, um, I've been so open when it comes down to initiating conversations with people. I just started talking to them. And whilst talking to them, all of a sudden I just saw free jerk seasoning being popped out. They're like, hey, we wanted to try this. Um, they knew I was Jamaican and we were just talking, like I said, and they gave me this. Also meant the Rastafarian man that you guys would have seen in the clips before this one. And it was just such a nice experience watching other people talk about your culture and how much they enjoy and identify with that culture. And you would have seen the clips, as I've said before, so I don't want to repeat everything that was said. But it was it was good knowing that there are people in Japan who you know, rock with their culture that kind of way because many people here don't know about Jamaica. So when I find people who are actually familiarized with Jamaica and the whole Jamaican culture and who are very much connected to it and identify with it, it's it's a heartwarming feeling. And um, yeah, I had a very good time. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, go ahead, click the like button, subscribe. If you haven't already, we're on the way to 1K. Hopefully by this video, we are, we are over the 1K mark. I love you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to share this video with a friend. Leave your comment in the comment bar below. And I will see you guys in the next video. I love you guys. Bye.